Hey Bulldogs, Chris Bryant here. I got a CCNP route and t-shoot video boot camp for you today. Going to bring a diagram up in about 10 seconds here and you're going to need to answer three questions for me. And as a matter of fact, let's get right to it and then we'll use a Cisco router to illustrate the answers. Now, in this particular diagram, you have two routers that have subnets of the major network number 20, 000 that is but they are both advertising only the major network number. They're not advertising their subnets. Now the first question obviously is how are we going to fix this? And the hint is there's one command that will take care of this for us. Now you learned about this command in your NA studies. So you probably know that one immediately. Second question though, what is the minimum number of routers you need to put that command on? and I want you to tell me exactly which routers you should put it on. And we, I didn't number these because I thought we had enough numbers, but we'll call this one router one, we'll call our hub router here router two, and this router, router three, exactly where would that command have to go? And then finally tell me where in the config it goes, whether it's an interface command, global command, routing protocol command, something else, and any options you would need to make this happen. So a lot going on there, and we're going to go over all of that in about 15 seconds. Thanks again for making me the number one instructor on Udemy, the online leader in education. It's a fantastic site. Come on out and check it out. And especially my CCNP all-in-one $99 course. You get all three of my courses, Route Switch and T-Shoot, for $99, over 50 hours of video boot camp training. I've got free courses for the NP out there as well as each individual course, Route Switch and T-Shoot, only $44 each. So please come on out and join us because we are over 9,000 strong out there now and we want you out there too. So let's go ahead and take a look at this question again. And the command here, and you probably jumped all over this fastball right down the middle of the plate, is no auto summary because auto summarization is going to be enabled by default. We need it to disable it in this situation. However, where do we need to disable it? And it's very common just to put no auto summary on every EIGRP config you ever write. It's so common that people tend to think no auto summary is the default setting, and that's why I want to make sure you know that it is not. But where you'd have to put it is on the routers doing the advertising. It's not required in this configuration on our hub router. And we tend to look at that hub and say, okay, that's where it needs to go. But the summarization is actually occurring on the advertising routers. So that's where no auto summary needs to go. If you only put it on the hub in this situation, it wouldn't work because the routes are already summarized by the time they get to that particular router. So again, no auto summary if you were asked the minimum number of routers to put it on, it would be two. You would need to put it on routers one and three here, uh, the two routers that are actually doing the advertising. Now, as for this command, where the heck does it go? Well, it goes under the EIGRP command, excuse me, mode, and auto summary is actually the first one listed here, enable automatic network number summarization. So to negate that, we'll just put a no in front of it. And believe it or not, for the first time in the history of history, or at least it seems that way, there are absolutely no options with this command. No subnet mask, no wildcard mask, no nothing. You just got to know it goes under the EIGRP AS configuration, and it's simply no auto summary. Thanks so much for taking today's CCNP quick quiz. We're going to have a new page on the website, actually two websites here in 2013, that'll have all of them. And of course, you can find them anytime on my YouTube channel. Thanks again for watching. I'm Chris Bryant, and thanks for making TBA part of your CCNP success story.